Well, if you love getting together with friends for game night, you may want to check out a new business in Portland. It's a place where you can play games while enjoying delicious food and even cocktails. Joe V is here in studio with the details. Hi, Joe. Hey, uh, good morning, guys. Yeah, you know, uh, growing up, a lot of us played tabletop games like D&D or Pokemon with our friends. Maybe we played while sitting around the kitchen table scarfing down junk food. But now we're grown up, we have jobs, some of us are morning meteorologists, and we want a more upscale experience. I was talking about Jeff Forge, Ron, Pokemon fan. Well, grab your 20-sided dice and your rare Venusaur. Did I say that right, Jeff? Because we have a place for you. I'm inside Mox Boarding House. I'm with Megan Hansen right here. Megan, tell me a little bit about Mox. This is pretty incredible. It's all sorts of different gaming under one roof, it seems. Absolutely. So we're all about tabletop. So as you can see, there's a bunch of board games, miniatures games, role-playing games, card games. And so you're welcome to bring your own game down and play with us. You can uh, grab one from us, or we also have our board game library back here that's totally free. So this is all of our miniatures space here. Here there's a bunch of uh, little figures that you put together and you paint them. It's a whole hobby, including the game itself too. So some people just paint, some people just play, and some people do both. We're playing some magic over over here. So this is Magic a Gathering, yeah. the card game, right? It is, yeah. It, Magic is is kind of the foundation of a lot of games just in general. There are Magic the Gathering cards that are like super rare and expensive and big collector's items, right? Absolutely. So this case here is a bunch of like our old Magic pack. You've got a pack of cards here that's $255 yeah. for one a pack of <laughs> Magic cards. Yeah, because they're all random, when you open them up, you don't know what you're going to get. The most valuable card in all of Magic is a Black Lotus. And if I remember correctly, I think the last one went for 60000 <laughs> Sorry, it sounded like you said 60,000. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, you can game anywhere, but you also have some private rooms that people can use. And we're going to go in one right yeah, now. Yeah, so this is the reading room. The reading room is my absolute favorite room in the entire place. And I think you can see why the ambiance in here is just wonderful. So here's what's really unique about this place. You've got obviously a bunch of people playing games behind me here, but if you're a little hungry, they've got a full on restaurant and a full bar here. This is chicken souvlaki, which is one of my favorites. Again, a full menu. We're not talking like Doritos and Red Bull. No, absolutely not. Actually, the charcuterie plate is one of my favorite things on the menu. Two cocktails here are the astrophysicist and the props choice. Uh, the astrophysicist is my favorite thing on the menu. It's a mezcal drink. So this is actually a game I know well. I play it with my friends, Settlers of Catan. So we'll have a little game here. Winner gets a souvlaki, okay? You're on. Come on, baby. Yeah, I'm gonna steal a resource from you, so shuffle up. Ah, <sighs> gosh. Oh, great haul. That's one victory point. Boom! All right. You know, Megan, I think this game will take another hour or two, so I'll just let the folks know that Mox Boarding House is located here off Burnside and 19th. And uh, why don't we just call this one a tie? Cheers. Mine. <laughs> I have. I've been to a lot of these like, game places, and they're all nice, but I've never yeah. seen one like that looked like this I'm with a full-scale restaurant. The food was really good. Even, like, I, I'm not kidding, and I didn't show this in here, but you go in the bathroom, there's this giant beautiful chandelier hanging like wow. in this yeah. ballroom. I mean, it's, it's a wow. really cool spot. So it's right off 19th and Burnside, so uh, go check them out.